Yo, 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 yo. Yo, 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 yo. Yo, 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 yo. What's going on, gang? It is once again show day. Just not for your boy this time. So we got Jeremiah, my boy, stepping on stage today for the second time. Uh, we rocked summer shredding about 13 days ago, just under two weeks. Brought a gnarly package, first time on stage, took third in his class against a, a stacked class. The, uh, the guy who won his class actually won the overall and is competing for his pro card today. Um, and then the dude who took second in that class um, just simply brought a little bit more sharper conditioning. Today, um, we are showing the accumulation of the, the work that we put in over the last uh, 13 days of not the entire amount of time was spent depleting but you know we ramped up cardio we dropped carbs back down low um, we took a different peaking approach than we did for summer shredding and it definitely has allowed us to come in a lot sharper a lot fuller than a couple weeks prior um, he is in that big fancy ass building over there we're in a really cool part of indy right now we're in westfield and it's like this doesn't do it justice. I know I, I shot some drone footage last year uh, where you could just see this shit looks like, I don't even know, like mini Beverly Hills. I've never been to Beverly Hills, so that's probably an awful comparison, but it's kind of what it reminds me of. Cool little area. He's in there. We're gonna go link with him, uh, run through some posing, and then I'll fill you guys in a little bit uh, later on, you know, what the peaking process looks like and, you know, the nitty gritty of, you know, what's the wins, the whys, the hows, but let's go link up with Jeremiah. So we got my boy here. We did pre-judging earlier this morning. Four people in his class, um, so. There wasn't really anybody able to be in the center, but you know we know he's between one and two right now. I'm calling one. Um, you know the conditioning's there. The front is definitely there. I wasn't sitting directly behind him. I was kind of off to the side, so I wasn't able to necessarily see you know who had it in terms of width or the most accurate angle. But I'm still calling that Jeremiah's taking number one. Um, about to find out real soon. What the what the true case is, but it's what we're hoping for. Yeah, what we worked for. Yeah, thanks. Let's see. Let's see what we're working with now. So, we had uh, rice cakes and honey for the first two meals this morning, um, and then we went to Five Guys uh, for the third meal. Had him get two orders of fries. Wanted to load up on sodium and carbs, um, and you know, kind of hope that it's going to help help him fill out more, be a little more vascular. Allow the physique to pop more on stage, which is what we need right now. I saw that he was a little bit flat after getting off stage, so let's run through this round of puzzle. Yeah. Added a lot of detail where we needed it out here. Come back to the front. Your stage right now is 212. 212. And then we were two, I think we were 211 last first summer show. Yeah, it was 213. 213. Okay, so we're basically around a pound down from last 
previous stage weight just under two weeks ago. Um, which, I mean, the, the look is significantly better. I wouldn't say it's directly reflective of just a pound's difference. I know we definitely pushed uh, for about 10 days of depleting. So, regardless, he's gonna go out there and do his thing. One thing that bro, we all just like notice is like how you go out there so confident. Like, dude behind me uh, that I was talking to on this, uh, she noticed that I was obviously like, with, with him being like, basically first time competitor, this is his second show in two weeks. It's like, that's one, not typical, two, I mean, it's critical. When you can go, there is a very distinct difference in like your stage presence in general when you go out there confidently versus unconfidently. And it's, it's usually just not a good look when you go out there unconfidently. Your posing is usually off. Um, you're usually doing unnecessary movement. When you can lock into your poses and hit them just like a statue, it's usually a sign that, you know, you did what you needed to in terms of practicing the posing. And, you do what you know you need to during the whole prep. Show day is usually really fucking simple. And fun. You don't have to worry and stress about shit. So I think the name of the game for the next like 45 minutes until he's back out on stage is just kind of chill out until it's time to pump up. Uh, we're gonna go watch. Um, and yeah, next time you guys see us, it'll probably be old boy on stage. Let's get it. So excited. Number 19, Sydney Dunn. Bring out her first place award. So there, Thank you. so there was a, a novice overall. Yeah. Okay, bro. Okay. Yeah, Dude, right. hell yeah, hell yeah, bro. I seen. So I was like, so when they had you out there for your open class, I was like, Dude. seeing you guys at that angle, yeah. where I could see you guys both head on. Yeah. It was no question. So like, give you guys a little bit of background. This morning, pre-judging, we were off to the side, and I, it was just a, an odd angle to be able to really compare. 
um, you know, Jeremiah and the first place guy in his class. But I think we just too much forward now. Yeah. I just don't think we're full enough. And I, I, I just, I don't. I wish we were a little fuller in the morning, but I, I don't even just really necessarily agree with that decision. That he won. Really? Yeah. No, definitely. You had the front. I think you, you had the back. You were definitely leaving. Yeah, I don't know what you want. It is what it is. We don't make excuses for it. I acted like a fool in that last part, bro. I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Nah, bro. I was like, you know, bro, because I, I could tell. I, I never seen them do that anyways. Like, stagger people on stage. Yeah, no, that was weird as fuck. I've never in my life seen that. Wow. But yeah, bro, I can tell you it's exciting. Bro. It feels great. It feels like six months of long hours of work and then putting myself through hell of bodybuilding and shit. Like, it's, it feels good. It feels really good. So, I know you're ready to <laughs> sleep, chill, eat a little more probably. Dude, I racked out when I went home between. Really? Yeah, I racked out. And then I get here, they put the coat of tan on and I'm like falling asleep standing up. So. I'm exhausted. This shit ain't easy. Yeah, so I guess game plan from here. So recap, we got first and novice, novice overall, and second in open class D. Not a huge show, bigger than what it was last year. But I think game plan now is, you know, first diet, give him a couple days just to my typical, you know, approach after somebody competes is I give them about 48 hours, eat as they please. I tell them, you know, I tell you, do not gain 10, 15, 20 pounds in two days, bro. Don't do it. But it's like, you know, if you want to have burgers two times a day, uh, pancakes for breakfast, go ahead, bro. 48 hours, eat how you want, and then we're going to lock back in for a reverse diet that typically is six to eight week, six to eight week period where we're going to just increase skyrocket calories. Um, in the name of recovery, in the name of improving training performance while trying to maintain as much conditioning, the shreds, the leanness as possible. And then there's usually, you know, a weekly cheat meal built in there. With my boy Jeremiah, this man has a freaky metabolism, his ability to stay lean, he trains hard as fuck, like an animal. So I know those calories are being utilized, uptaked, don't know if that's a word, but they're being put to good use. So. Him, you know, we had a we had two weekly cheat meals for a long time. I think that'll probably come back into play at some point, as long as we're able to be on our P's and Q's with the, you know, the diet. Right? I know, I know, you got a little bro. I remember telling you at the beginning of, just like when you hired me, not even just beginning of prep, like I just needed him to get a little bit of taste of it. I just like to go through a prep, get on a stage. I told him he was more likely than not been hooked. How you feel about it? I'm good. <laughs> I'm, I'm addicted. Yeah. Like, uh, I hate eating chicken and rice over and over and over again. Don't worry, we're going to throw some fried in there. But, but, like, obviously the shit works, so, like, Devin knows what he's doing, and I'm grateful for him. Couldn't have done without him, for sure. Yeah, bro. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of the game plan, and I'm, I'm sure you guys will see uh, next time we step on stage. I think it will be a different story, because when I look at Jeremiah's physique, it is, it is men's physique written all over. I think the name of the game is just coming a little bit tighter. We now have a lot of data um, to help us understand how to peak him better. I think he's somebody who can handle much more carbs um, than you know the average person. So I think it's the magic's going to come around timing that, and then just adding the size that we need. You know, he's 23 years old, natural, six two, six three, uh, and what. We'll, Peaked in our off season at 225. Yeah. 225 pounds in off season, natural. 6'2. Like, the boy got some muscle on him, but as always, you know, bodybuilding is an ever evolving game of get bigger, get bigger, get bigger. There's a cap on that now with the, you know, weight cap, but I'm rambling at this point. Good shit, my boy. Very, very proud of you, bro. It was really, you know, great to be a part of your first stage experience, man. But I know Can't you know it's time to work on, bro. Can't wait to see what we're going so yeah, all right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, if you are looking for a coach, if you're looking to step on stage, you're looking just to get shredded, if you're looking to add some muscle, hit your boy up. Instagram will be right here. 